Hello and welcome to Life After NARC. I'm Paula and if you're a subscriber, welcome back. And if you're new and you like this video, please subscribe. The Narcissist Hoover Maneuver. Like the Hoover Vacuum Cleaner, the Narcissist, after a breakup or discard, tries to suck you back in. Now, if you had the audacity to break up with the narcissist first, they might go after you with a vengeance. The reason being, how dare you break up with the narcissist? So they, with their super-sized colossal ego, is going to want to win you back so only to br get even with you and discard you because they have to win. They cannot allow you to discard them first. So that is a big, big narcissistic injury if you were to discard the narcissist and their super-sized ego. So that would be the first thing that would cause a giant Hoover maneuver. However, if you were discarded by the narcissist, then you might be feeling very brokenhearted because the narcissist causes you with their love bombing and all the promises they made that you are trauma bonded to them and it is like being a crack addict your addiction to them so if they left you for a new supply you might be lonely and longing for them to hoover you and you might be hoping for a hoover if they are deciding to grace you with their presence again which they could do because narcissists view people as objects so when they discarded you they weren't really maybe throwing you away forever because they looked at you as a piece of property that they owned and they just set you on the shelf for later that they might decide to return to you at any moment. Never mind that. But the problem being if they do return to you in a Hoover maneuver, they didn't have some magical fairy godmother sprinkling them with magical fairy dust that is suddenly going to make them have some epiphany or fill them with the things that they are missing. So when they Hoover you, Sure, they might love bomb you again. They might do all the future faking to you again, but they are not going to suddenly have the things that they were missing before. That being the most important ingredient, which is empathy caring about your feelings, seeing you as a separate person, caring about the pain that they have caused you, and what they will do if they hoover you and you allow them back in. They will begin the discard phase again. They will begin the devaluation again and they will probably do the devaluation even quicker and sooner than they did it before. So all the abuses that they did to you before, they will do to you again and a lot quicker than the first time. 
So why would they even return? It might be a failure of the new supply, but the new supply could be there. But the reason they would do it is because they are narcissists. And what are narcissists looking for? Supply, supply, supply. Money, sex, more supply, maybe sadistic pleasure and causing pain. Maybe they need a place to sleep. You know, maybe they want to triangulate you with the other sources of supply. The list could go on and on of why they are returning. But why ever they're returning, the outcome for you is not good unless you are addicted to the pain that they give you, which unfortunately you could be addicted to that pain. But that is really an addiction that you are going to want to break. So no matter how broken hearted you are, please do not let them back in because they can't give you what you really want. What you really want is to be loved, to be respected for the beautiful person that you are inside. So please close the door on the narcissist. That way you can open the door on a really good person someday, a person that can give you those things that you really deserve. You know, someone that will treat you as a person, a person, an equal, you know, not an object on a shelf. So anyway, um, how do I know this stuff? Because I was a person that let a narcissist hoover me and hoover me more than once and it caused a lot of pain and I don't want to see anybody else go through that pain. So anyway, thank you for stopping by and I would love to hear your comments.